in a business coaching session with one of our clients this week, we were reviewing their marketing plan for scaling their company and they had a great plan. But one thing that I find with almost every business owner, they forget to include this one untapped market. And let me explain. So most marketing plans, we, we do it for lead generation. We do it for prospecting. We do it. We also market for our current clients for retention. We also, many business owners, we do it for employees. In other words, for recruiting, we want our company to look like a place that, that you would want to work. We also do it for employee retention. And there's a lot of different other reasons for marketing, but there's one that I have found that I have found yet to find a business owner that has actually tapped into this because it is an area that affects the bottom line. It can save you a lot of money in the future. And that is vendors. Business owners, and when I mention that to business owners for scaling their business, they say, well, how, why would I market to vendors? Well, the reason you want to market to vendors is because you get better deals. I'll give an example from, from uh, one of the companies I started back in the 90s. When we first started out and we needed a banker, I had to seek out bankers. And not every banker wanted to work with our company. We were newly established. They didn't know anything about us. Did they want to be associated with our brand? But as we had a history being part of the community, as our business got older and more established, we had bankers coming to us like because we had marketed ourselves as a business that you want to do business with because we have a reputation. Uh, we're going places. And, you know, a lot of people, as you know, when they say, well, who are some companies you work with? They start listing off different company names, different brands. And, and it's like, oh, wow. OK, I need to use that company. So be thinking about how you can market to vendors as well. You'll get better rates, better uh, negotiations. You'll uh, get perks, bonuses, things like that. So it really does affect the bottom line by marketing and establishing yourself as a company that others want to do business with as well as it'll save you the headache of when you need a vendor for a particular product or service from you having to do all the legwork of reaching out and scheduling appointments with others. What we found was you'll just, you'll be inundated with people wanting to do business with you because of who your company is. So don't forget about putting the vendors into your marketing plan, especially if you're scaling up your business. For more small business facts, tips, and tricks, go to michaeldmorrison.com.